Hey, good morning, everybody. I hope everybody had a uh, great weekend. Um, yes, I do have my Tennessee Vols colors on, even though we got thumped by Alabama this weekend. I still love my Vols. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to be showing you how to play um, Kane Brown's Good As You. We are in standard tuning, capo on the first fret, uh, three chords in the entire song, which are G, F, C. I do my G this way. If you do not know how to make a G that way, um, ring finger, third fret of the low E, pinky, third fret of the high E, and index finger will be on the first fret of the B. And sometimes I'll play it with uh, that finger up, and sometimes down, but I'll show you as we go along. F, if you do not know how to make an F this way, um, index finger, first fret of the B, middle finger, second fret of the G, ring finger, third fret of the A, pinky, third fret of the D. Um, Strumming pattern is going to be down, down, up, down, 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 up. So, again, down, down, up, down, 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 Okay? Uh, the intro and the chord progression to the entire song is C, I'm sorry, G, F, and C. Uh, the intro goes like this. G, like I said, down, down, up, down, 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 up. Into the F. Then you're going to do uh, two, two times down on the C. Then do that little run. And you do not have to add that run if you don't want to. You just stay on the C. And then it will go back to the G. But uh, do that little run. His um, index finger will be on the first fret of the B. Second, uh, well, middle finger will be on the second fret of the G, and you're just gonna uh, pick those two strings, slide up uh, two frets. So instead of being on the first and second fret, you're gonna slide up to the third and fourth fret. Slide up. Then you'll go back to the first and second fret. So slide up to the third and fourth, and then back to the um, first and second, and you'll pick. Okay? Then you'll um, you'll pick the um, Second fret of the G string, pull off, and then you'll pick the um, D string on the second fret, and then pick it open. So again, slide, pick, slide, and then pick. G, you'll be using your index finger. So that little part again. Which you can be pick, down, and hammer on. Then you go pick down and then up. And then you'll pick up and down. Then when you come up, lift your finger off the string. Do that again real slow. Okay, that whole little part again.
like I say, you do not have to add that into the song if you don't want to. That's just a load extra. Um, that makes it sound really good. And it's not exactly what he does in the song, but I think it works well with it, and I think it sounds good. And then, like I said, the rest of the song is just that same chord progression, uh, chord progression uh, G, F, and C. I'll play along with the song just a little bit uh, to show you how it kind of goes. Also, one thing I should point out, um, a palm mute, just resting my palm on the back of the strings here towards the uh, saddle, um, just so the strings ain't ringing out as much, and uh, it just gives the song a little bit of a better feel. So I'm going to back up to the beginning and uh, show you again. Like I say, that's pretty much the entire song. Um, G, F, C, same chord progression um, throughout. Um, please leave a comment. Let me know what you think of this lesson. And as always, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.